So I am genuinely still recovering from what took place at our house on Sunday night. What happened? An impromptu dance party. I, I will not play the video because it's a song that would give us a potential strike, but this is this is this will give you kind of the vibe that was going on there. Um mm -hmm. okay. yeah, so that that'll give you the vibe. I don't know if you can see that. But it's Andrani and our friend Valerie and Joanna dancing and Mickey was there. Valerie directed it was, the header monologue I did, by it, the way. Yeah, it was impromptu dance party that began at ten o'clock and didn't end till about one thirty. We just nonstop danced around the living room. Indrani put the girls in dresses that they hadn't come dressed in. And I'm blaming a brand new spirit that we've enjoyed called Old Raj. Not only is it the most delicious gin I've ever heard, but it produces pretty freaking fantastic nights. Sounds like a hell of an orgy. It was. Josh! Hey, welcome back to our stupid directions of Corbin. I'm Old Raj. And you can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thanks to Patreon, follow us account, subscribe and like button. It was a blast. Uh, but I, I am genuinely, we just, all five of us were just choosing songs and going, we did not stop. The windows were all steamed up. <laughs> we were writing things on the windows. We had to open the windows, even though it was probably, you know, three degrees Celsius. Heck of an orgy. It was, I'm genuinely, it was 48 hours ago, I'm still... Recovering. It was glorious. Uh, today we got a... This is kind of a documentary uh, somebody sent me. It's called... Say this? Braj Kiholi. And I think it's uh, going over... I, I know we know about Holy, but this one is actually a documentary. Um, uh, Film the documentary. Did your... Uh, I thought it was going to... Uh, read, read this. In the Braj region of India where the Hindu deity Krishna grew up, the festival celebrated until Ran Pancham. Oh, Panchami, excuse me, in commemoration of the divine love of Radha for Krishna, Holi celebrated as a festival of so, love. Um, obviously, we know Holi, and we've seen many stuff about Holi. We and celebrate Holi every year. We, and we've actually had the blessing of celebrating it in Mumbai. Yes. Just uh, before the pandemic exploded. And the, the night before, I forget what the night before Holi is called, but when they right, the bonfire, the bonfire and we did that whole thing. We sure did. If you have vlogs of that, please go check those out. They are there. They are on the channel. Just look up OSR Holi and you'll find them. Um, but... I think this goes over a little different stuff, so. Cool. Here we go. Holi, Hindu dharm ka prachin tiyohar hai, jo ki vasant ritu ki falgun purnima ko manaya jata hai. Holi ko rango ka tiyohar aur prem ka pratik mana jata hai. जहाँ प्रेम की बात हो और राधा कृष्ण की बात ना हो ऐसा हो ही नहीं सकता प्रेम जो सदियों से होली के रंगों के रूप में लोगों पर बरसता रहा है इस प्रेम से सराबोर होली को मनाने के लिए खुद राधा कृष्ण के ब्रज से ज्यादा अच्छी जगह भला क्या होगी दुनिया में तो होली सिर्फ एक दिन की होती है लेकिन ब्रज की होली का त्योहार पूरे चालीस दिन oh, wow. होता है जो वसंत पंचमी से लेकर होली का दहन के दो दिन बाद तक चलता है जिसमें कि बरसाने की लठमार और लड्डूमार नंदगांव की लठमार वृंदावन में बिहारी जी और आखिर में दाव जी का wow. रंगा बेहद प्रसिद्ध है wow. बसंत पंचमी के दिन ब्रज में होली का डाणा गढ़ता है और इसी के साथ शुरुआत होती है दुनिया की सबसे अनूठी होलियों की इस दिन से ब्रज के सभी प्रमुख मंदिरों में ठाकुर जी के अबीर गुलाल लगना शुरू हो जाता है शाम को घर के साथ समाज गायन होता है जिसमें सभी लोग मिलकर होली के गीत गाते हैं और आने वाले 40 दिनों तक यह उत्सव रोज होता है होली से लगभग आठ दिन पहले यानी कि फाल्गुन शुक्ल पक्ष की अष्टमी को राधा रानी के गांव बरसाना से श्री कृष्ण के नंदगांव फाग का निमंत्रण भेजा जाता है जिसमें बरसाने की सखिया नाचते गाते हुए नंद भवन में ठाकुर जी को जाता है कि जब द्वापर युग में राधा रानी के होली निमंत्रण को स्वीकार करने के बाद श्री कृष्ण ने अपने सखाओं को बरसाना भेजा था तो उनका स्वागत राधा रानी की सखियों ने लड्डुओं से किया था 
Here's what I'll do. कृष्ण अपने सखाओं के साथ नंदगांव से बरसाना गए थे जहां वे राधा रानी और उनकी सखियों संग होली खेले थे श्री कृष्ण राधा रानी संग हंसी ठिठोलिया करने लगे जिससे चिढ़कर राधा रानी और उनकी सखियां श्री कृष्ण और लठ बरसाने लगी और उन्हें भगा दिया यह प्रथा तब से आज भी बरकरार है जिसमें बरसाना की महिलाएं जिन्हें हुरियारिन कहा जाता है बगलबंद पगड़ी पहन अपने बचाव के लिए ढाल के साथ आए हुए नंदगांव के पुरुषों पर जिन्हें हुरियारे कहा जाता है रंगीली गली में प्रेम भरे लठ बरसाती है Completely different form of clubbing. <laughs> thank you, thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> so, I've wanted to do this all year. Wow. He is covered. Shot gets me motion sickness. Oh. के दिन नंदगांव में लठमार होली खेली जाती है यहाँ की लठमार होली के बारे में कहा जाता है कि जब श्री कृष्ण अपनी सखाओं के साथ बरसाना की गोपियों से होली खेलने के बाद बिना फगुआ यानी नेग दिए आए थे फगुआ लेने के लिए नंदगांव जाकर होली खेलने की इच्छा जताई थी तभी से बरसाने की लठमार होली के ठीक अगले दिन नंदगांव में भी लठमार होली खेली जाती है बरसाने से वीडियोग्राफी इज ग्रेट या स्वागत यहां के गोस्वामी समाज के लोग करते हैं नंद भवन में दर्शन के बाद हुरियारी यशोदा कुंड पहुंचकर भांग और ठंडाई का आनंद लेते हैं जिसके बाद मंदिर में हुरियारों का सामना नंदगांव की गोस्वामी समाज के लोगों से होता है जिसमें के फूलों के रंग और अबीर गुलाल से सराबोर हुरियारे समाज गायन करते हैं शाम को नंदगांव की हुरियारे ने यहाँ के रंगीली चौक पर बरसाने से आए हुए हुरियारों का इंतजार हाथों में लठ लिए करती हैं और फिर शुरू होती है प्रेम रस से भरी लठमार They're really whacking yeah. it. Wow. Holy does make everything so picturesque, that's for sure. I also love shots in, in villages and towns where they got the same color blues on every building. Yeah, I think that's in, I think this is in Rajasthan. It's in, did they say? I, I, I if they did, said. I've forgotten. It might be the blue city. Which they used to do for cast, mm. but now it's kind of like a tourist thing. Oh, is that the reason? It was cast coloring? That's not such a beautiful oh, they've, reason. They've changed it now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But. Nice. That's just lovely. This is the first time I've ever seen this. In Vrindavan, there are five days of holy. Here, this day, there are many people who have been in the country. There are many people who have been in the country. और इसी के साथ ठाकुर बाके बिहारी समेत सभी प्रमुख मंदिरों में भक्तों और उनकी आराध्य के बीच शुरू हो जाती है गुलाल और रंगों भरी पिचकारी की होली 
that's cool. I want one of those. Boom, de ba ba, chicka chicka boom, chicka chicka boom boom, chicka chicka boom, chicka chicka boom boom, pika pika boom. Whoa! Oh yeah, I almost ordered. No, I did. I ordered one last year. It didn't work well. Ah. What are those called? It starts with a P, right? Those little, I don't like remember. Pichicoli man or something like that? Hmm. Wow. I want to know what kind of camera they were using. Seriously. Or if it was just all color correction, which is probably what they did as well. That Pichkari, yeah. Pichkari. I was close. Because when I had that in India I was, and I had two in my pocket, they called me Pichkari Man. Which is my superhero name. This is somewhere in Rajasthan. Watch me be wrong. This is just the day that all the women take revenge on the men. <laughs> yeah, I like it. Wow. Constant color just coming out of that hose. Wow. My goodness. Looks like they're in at least ankle deep water too. <laughs> just dumping buckets. <laughs> I guess don't wear clothes that you that you care about. That is holy next level. <laughs> Beating them. <laughs> I respect the tradition. Wow.
Uh. What a great video. Wow. Hats off to uh, Vagabond Films. Yeah. Uh, for making a fantastic. Uh, great. Especially like visually, it's like. Is, you know, I'm hoping you submitted this, um, which I feel like India should do for like documentary. You can make a film that is about holy, but also more like follow a family or something. Like, right. Kind of like they did with um, All That Breeze and like their drama. Right. But it's about the birds, but then you also get more. Absolutely. Um, but <laughs> like on Holy or Diwali or whatever, uh, the 10,000 other festivals they have. And like people would learn a lot. And also it'd probably be a, a, a it could be a powerful documentary. Absolutely. Uh, maybe I'll make it, but I don't think I'm qualified to make it because I don't know enough. Uh, <laughs> but I know like so we, many. But it, yeah, it could be made, uh, you know, it actually would be a beautiful perspective to have it made by someone who isn't India mm. and Indian and and just allow it to be their view of those things, yeah. take, drinking that in. So, yeah, yeah what but, a beautiful video. And it's super interesting because obviously uh, we've been doing this for four years now, I think for, for going on five, I guess, right? We're, we, we are now entering year... We are entering year five. So we're all right, we've done yeah we've four, done four years and 19, four 20, years 21, 22. we've celebrated holy correct the first year we kind of just threw we went up on the hill with the kids the with the my second kids. year we were in India in India which is crazy <laughs> and then COVID game COVID game um, but I've 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 played holy every year with my family mm -hmm. at least in the backyard yeah uh, Leland loves it he's I need to make sure I have holy. I was just gonna say, have you ordered your they, colors yet? Well, um, actually, if you just go to yeah, an the, Indian grocer, they'll have it. They have it. Yeah, they have uh, like fireworks and stuff for like Diwali and mm -hmm. any kind of stuff. Yeah. Um, not like big fireworks, but like sparklers and stuff. But I need to make sure I have some of that. Um, but yeah, to learn something that we haven't learned yet about this specific celebration. I love that. It just seems like the day of the year that all the women take out their frustration and anger. Oh, yeah. 364 <laughs> days of patriarchy. <laughs> and now we have our turn. I know that's not what it's actually no, about. No, it's just, a joke. It's a joke. It's just, uh, it, it, it seems funny in that in yeah, that light. I, uh, I like it. It's It looks like a... I don't know if I would do it. It just seems really intense on a lot of people. My goodness. Well, the totality of it is 40 days long. That is that's that is biblical in its perspectives in terms of festivities. Also, you know, and there's festivals. not 40 days that goes on in India that another festival doesn't come along. Of course. So you're celebrating two festivals at the same time the sometimes? The land of festivals. <laughs> there's no way there's a 40-day gap between festivals in India. No. No. I just, I know for a fact that's yeah. not the case. No, absolutely. Um, but yeah, a fantastic documentary. Any of you from this region and have partaken of this celebration? <laughs> There's no way it's not in Rajasthan. It just the, all the Everything all the lakes look, felt, look yes. Rajasthan, not the parts and the architecture. Uh, what the ladies were wearing. Yep. Um, do, 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 but again, the the director of photography, the, all the videography was just gorgeous. It, it looked like it was shot on a red camera with perfect color correction at the end. Um, yeah, it was probably shot on something like that. Anyways. Fantastic little documentary. Shout shout out to Vagabond Films Vagabond making films, a guys. great uh, making great content there. Let us know what are the videos we can react to and uh, holy hey. Just.